Hello guys what's up, so I'm back again for another tutorial video. So in this video, I will gonna show you how you can install eTrade on your PC or laptop, so if you are interested then keep on watching. But before all that, if you are new to my channel consider to like and subscribe for more videos like this, and also, you can comment down below if you have something that you want me to make a tutorial about. So without further ado, let's start the tutorial. So to install eTrade on your PC or laptop, it's actually pretty easy, just follow what I'm gonna do. So for the first step, I want you to go to your Microsoft Edge browser. Reminder guys, you can't use any other web browser, you must only use Microsoft Edge in order for this to work, but if you don't have a Microsoft Edge, you can download it on Chrome easily, just search for Microsoft Edge download and then you will now be able to find the website where you can download it. And once you already have your Microsoft Edge, just go and open it. And once you're on your Microsoft Edge, next, I want you to go to the official website of eTrade, so just go and search this. And now that you are on the website of eTrade, let me now show you how to download the app. So to do that, just click this three dots at the top. And then select the apps option. And after that, you will now be able to see the install this site as an app option right here just go and click it and then just rename the app as eTrade after renaming you can now click the install button to start installing the app and after that it's done your eTrade app will now be installed so just log in or create your eTrade account and then you will be able to use it and by the way guys you might notice that even after installing your eTrade you might still not find the app on your desktop home screen so to fix that just go back to the app. And once you're on the app, I want you to click this three dots right here. And then select app settings. And finally, for the last step, just click this create desktop shortcut button to add the app to your desktop home screen. And after that, it's done. Congratulations, the app will now be on your desktop home screen. And so that's just how you do it guys. Now that you've watched this video you can now do it yourself. So that concludes our tutorial video for today, I hope it helped you, thanks for watching, goodbye.